How's it going, everyone? My name is Jake with TradeConfident.io. Thanks so much for joining me in today's Bitcoin video. We're super excited to talk about this. We have major news from FTX, and I'm going to be going over the CPI report and how this report and the market's reaction to it was really confusing to me. From there, I'll be talking about all the technical analysis, where I think Bitcoin is heading next, and giving you our risk management strategy that we use to navigate the crypto markets. And I got to tell you, these indicators combined with our risk management strategy has earned us 69 wins and zero losses in our membership scalping trades. Now, before we jump into it, I have to let you know these indicators are on sale for a massive $600 off right now. But time is running out. It ends this Friday and there are limited coupons. So be sure to snag the indicators at the links in the description before time runs out. More on that later. Let's get into the analysis. Some news that I think you need to be aware of. FTX crypto purge. Court gives green light to $3.4 billion liquidation blitz. If we scroll down here, we're going to see in a significant development for the cryptocurrency market, the bankrupt exchange FTX has received court approval to liquidate its crypto assets worth over $3.4 billion. The decision delivered by Judge John Dorsey overruled objections and permitted FTX to proceed with selling, staking, and hedging of its holdings. FTX's crypto assets include several notable holdings with $1.1 billion in Solana, $560 million in Bitcoin, $192 million in Ethereum, 137 million in APT, 119 million in XRP, and $46 million in STG. However, concerns have arisen within the crypto community regarding the potential implications on the prices of these cryptocurrencies as a result of the liquidation. On this matter, renowned crypto expert Michael Van de Pope, apologies if I got that wrong, suggests that the market impact of FTX's approval to sell $3.4 billion in assets, combined with the worse than expected consumer price index data, we'll go over that in just a second as well, is expected to be limited. Some quick CPI data for you. CPI for all items rises 0.6% in August, gasoline and shelter up. In August, the consumer price index for all urban consumers increased by 0.6%, seasonally adjusted and rose 3.7% over the last 12 months, not seasonally adjusted. The index for all items, less food and energy, increased by 0.3% in August, up 4.3% over the year. If we take a look at this chart, August 2023 with a 0.6% increase is actually the largest that we've seen this year. Take a look at these readings. 0.6% is a major adjustment. However, it is worth noting that the 12 months adjusted is actually not the highest. But from the seasonally adjusted changes from preceding month, 0.6 is actually the largest increase we've seen all year. I'll be honest with you, the market's reaction to this was really surprising. I was expecting a drop in the general markets cryptocurrency included, but instead we've actually gotten a rise to structural resistance up here at $26,834. We've officially met our bullish prediction. And at this point, it's important that I talk to you about whether we could continue back to the upside or drop back down to previous supports. And with that, let's dive into the technical analysis itself. First up, price versus well money flow is showing well money flooding into the market. This is solely responsible for the moves up in Bitcoin. Where well money goes, the price is likely to go too, and that's why it is crucial that we pay attention to this metric. At the same time, trades in favor is very nearly in its short trade zone with a 76% chance of a drop. Both of these indicators in their top sections typically read very bearish for the crypto market. And if you want proof of that, if we scroll back here, right here, price versus well money flow is high, trades in favor was high, this was an extended period of time. We saw a strong sell and a sell signal. Both of these resulted in the drops to the levels that we are today. Right back here, price versus well money flow high. Trades in favor was kind of in the middle, but still decently high with a sell signal. This resulted in a move down. Back here, price versus well money flow high. Trades in favor high, strong sell signal, move down in Bitcoin. It's a very, very repeatable pattern. Very, very reliable. So as the price reaches its top sections again, as we see well money top out, become overbought and begin selling money out of the market, as we see upward momentum run out, we see short trade zone readings with a over 80% chance of a drop. That's where we're looking for moves down, especially if we see a sell or strong sell signal at this level. Now we've already run into really strong local structure resistance right about here at 26,834, as I talked about earlier in this video, but there is still a possibility that we test the next structure resistance right about here at $28,184. This would be a monumental win for Bitcoin. If we can rise back above that, 
that, I think we'll be in really good shape. However, as I said, this is a really strong structure resistance. And at this point, especially with the higher up readings on the indicators, I think it's more likely we could drop to test either structure support here or here, somewhere in this range between 25,350 and 24,750. It's hard to tell exactly what's gonna happen, but if FTX over here starts to sell out, especially if they sell out of their entire holding at the same time, I think this is more likely to be bearish. However, I wanna let you know, next month's FOMC meeting, this is where this month's inflation data really comes into play. At this FOMC meeting, the Federal Reserve is going to decide whether or not they're going to hike up interest rates. If they do end up hiking interest rates, this is very likely to drop the crypto market. If not, this is very likely already priced into the crypto market, so not too much to worry about there. Now, before we conclude this video, I wanna show you our risk management strategy. I'm gonna maximize this pane really quick just to make it a little bit easier to see. Then I'm gonna turn off the drawings. On the TC top and bottom finder, there is some built-in risk management. You're gonna click the settings, show take profit, market order buy limit one and buy limit two. Click okay and you're gonna see all of these lines on the right side. When you are ready to enter a trade, and I'm not saying now is a good time or a bad time to enter a trade, that is ultimately up to you. But if you decide to enter a trade the way I personally like to do it, not financial advice, just my personal opinion and experience, I like to split my investment into three equal parts. When I'm ready to enter the trade, the first part goes into the market order at the price indicated here. A market order is just gonna enter immediately at whatever the current price is, easy peasy. That'll get you into the trade. And then from there, I'm gonna set my take profit at this line, this price right here, which is 4% above the market order. Now, of course, you can adjust this higher if you'd like. I just personally like to shoot for a 4% profit. From there, I'm gonna enter the remaining two parts into buy limit one and buy limit two. Here's the reason for this. A lot of traders like to use a stop loss, and if the price drops below that, it'll automatically exit them out, but then anything in this area is a complete loss. Instead, what we like to do is set these buy limits, and if the price drops below a buy limit, Rather than sell out, it actually gets you into a better position. This is because you've now entered twice the amount of money into the market at a lower price. This brings your break even lower and significantly increases your profit potential. The price has to move up significantly less before you're in profit, so you'll be in profit much faster and with twice the amount of money in the market, fully increasing your profit potential. This is why we like to use this strategy. And if the price drops all the way below buy limit two, I really hope that's not gonna happen. But if it does, it just brings your break even lower, bringing you into profit even faster, and you have triple the amount invested into the market that you would have in the first place. It is a win either way. Either you get profit immediately or you get into a much better position and then you have to wait a little bit, but the profit later on is worth it. This is our risk management strategy. This combined with all of the indicators you see on this chart are responsible for our 69 win, zero loss win rate on our memberships. And you have just a limited amount of time to get the full $600 off. This is the biggest sale we've had yet. And if you want to snag these indicators and level up your trades, you better do it quick because you just have a couple of days left to do so. Snag the indicators at this amazing price while you still can at the links in the description down below. Just go ahead and scroll down, click more, and the indicator link is the second one right here. Click that. It'll bring you to our Labor Day sale page. Limited to the first 100 buyers. So not only is there a time limit, there's a quantity limit as well. Well, just to show off a little bit, just a little humble brag here, this person made almost $9,000 with their account up over 39% using these indicators. This person made $950 in one day. This person made $4,300 in just a week. These indicators are incredible and the best possible deal actually goes to our members. It is significantly cheaper to purchase a membership, super cheap, $59 a month, easy, easy, with a ton of benefits on its own. One of them being a massive $200 off sale code. It is significantly cheaper to purchase the membership and then the indicators than it is to purchase the indicators without it. So grab your membership, grab the access code right here and then click pro indicator pack. Click I want this, enter in that membership coupon code here and then fill out your information. Click pay, it's gonna offer you the $400 off discount for the TC top and bottom finder combined with the $200 membership discount gets you a full $600 off. Go ahead and click add to cart, follow the prompts and we're so excited to trade with you soon. With that, I just want to say thanks so much for watching. Trade safe, trade confident, and I'll see you in the next video.